Hey everybody, I am CNJMC1 and welcome to Space Engineers! Space Engineers is a sandbox, space style, build your spaceship type sandbox game. No, I fell down! <laughs> how did I how did I do that already? I don't know. But uh, yeah, Space Engineers is like um, a space-based sandbox game where you can build ships and build even bigger ships and stations and all that kind of stuff. And other people have been doing this and I got the game fairly recently like a couple of days ago I've been spending that time trying to get used to the game so I don't look like a complete moron and now I know the basic stuff of it like I am I think I can comprehend the more complicated stuff but yeah I got the simple controls down um, for those of you who are new to space engineers if you see it uh, if you see this video um, hi um, I'm not going to do a tutorial like maybe I'll like when I end up doing some complicated stuff, I'll like tell you um, how I'm doing it, or like tell you guys how I'm doing it, what to do, stuff like that. But for like the basic things, like control, control, setting up the game, stuff like that, I really won't be. Dang it, not again! <laughs> I really won't be focusing that much on it because at make at the making of this video, I'm assuming that um, you have some kind of general knowledge about this. Now. I will tell you guys that um, I set this on safe because I really find asteroids annoying. Maybe later on I'll edit the save. I'll edit the save file and add asteroids when I feel like it. But right now I feel like they're really big pain, and um, I don't have much of a ship. I started on Lone Survivor with um, there's supposed to be seven asteroids in here, but I forgot. Uh, maybe there are only four, but yeah, there's one. I really. I think those are more. You see, it's really to me. It's hard to tell the small asteroids from the uh, background. Like I think th those are real asteroids. Like that one, that one, that one, and those are the background ones. Like, in my opinion, they're really hard to tell the difference. But I spent too much time talking already. Let's actually get with the game. So da 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 da. da. I'm gonna get my tools out. Oh yeah, wonderful, wonderful tools. Now, the question in my mind: How much uranium is in he here? Not a lot, so I think I should get some uranium from somewhere. But if I but if I know correctly that this is just uh um this is just like one of those asteroids where everything is on the inside. And so that one just looks like a donut. <laughs> that is a donut asteroid. Um I read somewhere that um donut shaped planets and asteroids are possible in physics, it just doesn't happen. I might be wrong with that. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not like Scott Manley or whatever on this topic, but yeah, I think I'm gonna have to go to a different asteroid. Like this can be my base. That's the platform beacon. Yeah, that works. Um, let's go in here. Let's see if we can find any uranium. If I really can't find any uranium, because I've never played on this, and that's a really small amount of uranium that's in that reactor, and I want, might not be able to refine uh, much uranium in order to make more uranium because you have to refine uranium and refining like a lot of uranium only gives you like a small amount and yeah this might be a doomed start now that I think about it but you know let's see how this happens if this is a doomed start then um I'm just I'm just I'm just gonna keep this in here I turned off uh, inertia dampeners with Z or Z if you're in the UK my don't know in San Spanish but um I think it's Zay in German. I don't know. I, I, I'm taking German as my foreign language and stuff. Anyways, let's see if we can find any uranium. This is iron. Hello, iron. Um, is there any uranium in here? Is it just iron all day, every day? Uh, this is just stone, I'm pretty sure, right? Let me see. Is it stone? Uh, I don't see what the thing just chipped off. I'm just gonna slowly walk away until crap gets less weird. Um, no, that's not it. Wasn't I looking into this cavity of like iron earlier? Oh yeah, there it is. Is there more in this cavity? It's just all iron in here. Wow. Um, hello. Any any uranium here? Hello. Hello. Picking up that monster city of a. I really hate it that you have to like pick up a block, not like a block, but like the chunk of ore, 
It's really annoying. And for those of you who do play this game like regularly, um, you'll see that drills sometimes also let loose some of these things, and they just like clutter up the world and just make the game like a lot harder to play because the save files get bigger and stuff. Well, save files don't get bigger, it's just really annoying to have to pick up everything. Um, in my opinion, I think you should just like be able to like get it instantly, like have it instantly be put into your inventory. But uh, there seems to be no uranium in here. I think I might be right by the doom start, actually. Hmm. There's like no uranium in here. Actually, surprised that I found my way out of that thing easily. Uh. Is this another one of those asteroids where like everything is in the inside? Because I really want to find one of those asteroids that are like cracked everywhere. Oh, is that your? Is that just a world? Oh, there, there is. There you go. Textures had to be loaded and stuff. But here is uranium. This really black thingy over here. So I'm just gonna mine this. Da -da -da, mine. Where'd he go? Chunks fell out and stuff. Are these like actual chunks that you can pick up? If so, you can. I want that. Um, I'm. I kind of want this now. Stop teasing me. There you go. Where'd everything go? There it is. Sorry about the frame rate issues. Um, I'm pretty sure it's my graphics card because I put in like a GeForce GT graphics card. I think it's like nine hundred nine nine fifty nine hundred ninety five hundred, and um, it's an outdated graphics card. And if it doesn't prove, if it doesn't bode well with my frame rate in this game and other games that I'm going to be playing, then I'll switch back and hopefully that'll be better. But um. I kind of like it. It's decent. Come back here. Excuse me. Come back here. Another thing I don't like about this game with these chunks is that you can hit them and they go flying way much faster. And I also hate doing this every time I just want to pick up an ore. It gets really annoying. I mean, you have a if you make like a cave inside of here, then it won't be too much of a problem. But still, it's a problem in my opinion. I just kind of like do this and spam T. It just kind of like actually lets you pick up some things and make like a tunnel. But they still, some of them still end up flying off into space. Like see this? Yeah. There's supposed to be one right under me, isn't there? There you go, right there. Yeah. Come back here. There you go. I hope there's there's one over there. Also, another thing that I'm going to complain about in this game is that a lot like I think it's for uranium magnesium and plutonium a lot of ore gives you like very minuscules a very minus minuscule amount of ingots of that material so like 1k of this one one kilogram of uranium might equal to like one gram of uranium bars or ores or whatever they're called but uh yeah that's another thing i really don't like about this game but overall i think this game is really fun um i'm planning on making a multiplayer with um, a friend of mine who also has this game i'm trying to work out some a few kinks in like video and recording and stuff like that but once i find work that out um i'll be able to play multiplayer and record it for you guys and I re and me and that friend I've already tried to like do a series a couple of times and they kind of failed so I'm just gonna work out the kinks and make a series me and that me and my friend we had like a lot of fun playing this game we had like a lot of funny experiences experiences and I'm hoping I'm bringing those experiences uh, to you guys because um me my friend and I were fairly entertained while playing this game and we're ho and we're hoping on catching even more funny moments while recording um well let's you, come here come here okay how much do we have we have like 326 uranium uh is that another yeah here it is there you go Da -da 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 -da. 
It's always kind of awkward to like turn around because your model actually kind of hits these things also. Um, kind of like bumping these and they kind of like make them go spinning and flying out into space. There is like um a limit to how many of these things you can actually have in, in like in your world. You can actually set a limit. Like for me, I have 256 because I really don't want to bother having like a lot of them and I have never re reached that limit, but I'm pretty sure if I have reached, I'm pretty sure that if I do reach that limit, it just stops spawning them, and it just stops spawning them, or it starts deleting things that ha are old, and spawn new ones, and I'm hoping those two are the case, one of those, one of those two scenarios are the case, because I've actually never reached that limit, and I really have no idea what that limit actually does. So, trying to get uranium. I should try and probably head back and try and refine this. Come here, 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 come here. Come here. There you go. Oh, oh, if I didn't get that, that thing would have like went flying. Okay, let's get back to the platform. Yeah, but all, but um, I should men. I think I mentioned this, but apart from like these things that I mentioned like the ores and how they like make chunks and how they're annoying to pick up and how they can fly away when you hit th when you hit them with your player model um, other than that I really love this game like I really genuinely love this game um, if there is like an actual mod for I'm just gonna like remove this I have no idea why this is here if there's an actual mod where you can have it so that um, What's it called? What's this called? The hand drill can like pick it up automatically without having to drop those things. I would love to get that. If one of you guys could, who are potentially watching this video, could tell me about that, that would be amazing. Now, here's the thing I'm worried about. If I put uranium in here, it's going to refine that, but it makes such minuscule amounts. Like, that's probably going to make like 0.5. 0.5 yeah like that's 0 0.5 and I'm pretty sure that's just gonna make that and that's gonna be put here but I'm pretty sure this is like gonna drain its power like really fast and such I'm going to recharge myself I'm going to recharge my suit there you go <laughs> wrong button T there you go press K by accident yeah like I um I started playing this game like a cup a while ago so I could get like a feel for it but uh, so I could get a feel for it but I haven't like completely mastered everything um, yeah let's see this well I must I might be wrong there was a recent update that where like one kilogram of this would equal one of that but I might be mistaken maybe a hundred grams of this actually makes one of this that might be something I haven't um, heard about yet, but let's put that press button in here. We got more uranium. Yay. So I'm going to let that do its thing, and I'm going to just go here. I don't want to bother walking back there. It's a lot more convenient. Oh, come on. <laughs> wow. Am I st No, I'm not stuck. I, was I thought I was stuck for a second there. In my opinion, it's much more convenient. Like the medical bay, for those of you who don't know, is like if you build one, that's where you're going to spawn. I don't know how you can set a medical bay as your spawn. I might have to look into. I'm gonna have to look into that. But I know that if you die, you spawn at a medical room that you build. I'm not sure, like, because sometimes if you don't have a medical room, then you keep spawning in yellow ships, and I really don't want that to happen. So I'm hoping I'll spawn on here. But in other games, and like other, I don't know, like saves that I play, um, dang it, <laughs> in, other sa in other saves that I play, I, I have medical room, but I keep spawning in yellow ship, and I'm wondering if I can stop that from happening. Let me just real quickly get the uranium from here, and put it in here. 
Yeah, there, a recent update must have happened while I didn't realize, when I didn't realize it. But, um, uranium does isn't used up as quickly as I remember it. And refinery, um, is much more fit, uh, you can get much more, um, uranium ingots out of uranium ore than I remember. So, um, that's good. So, I forgot where that huge asteroid that I was flying towards was. I think it was in this direction, maybe? Uh, let's see. Iron? Iron? Iron! Not now. Um, let me go to... I might build, you know what? I might build like a space station right in the middle of that donut. <laughs> right in the hole of that donut. That's gonna, that's gonna be something funny to do. Uh, but, um, I'm gonna head here now. Da -da 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 space flight. Cause, you know, space. Actually, hold on. One, two. Uh, three, four. Th where, where am I heading? Um, yeah, here. Oh, I'm gonna hit something. <laughs> I'm so glad I figured that out. I'm about to hit that or that. But, um, yeah. One, two, three, four, five. So, I, no, that's not. Four and the donut one, which I forgot where it was, but that's going to make it five. So, yeah, I do have seven asteroids selected. I just don't know where the other two or three are. Because I couldn't find that donut one. It makes it, I couldn't find three. But, um, let's find this uranium spot because I want to like get a lot of uranium so I don't have to deal with it later on I mean I'm gonna have to come back and get more but I just kind of want to get myself set up so I can do other stuff such as building and stuff can I find that spot please thank you um it's right here oh here it is here it is here it is I think it might be a different one. No, I think it's the same one. I think it's the... Does it have indents? Yes, it does have indents in it. This game is really... This game can be really bright sometimes, and it can be really dark. Um, just do this and spam T. It's my strategy. There you go. There you go. Hello. Oh, there you go. That was a huge chunk. Um... That's a really big cavity. That's why I like doing that. I'm just gonna go over here, pick up this chunk. There you go. Any more flying off into oblivion? I'm probably not going to see, but I'm gonna try anyways. There you go. Wait, oh, give me. I saw that one. There you go. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. Give me. I saw that one. I saw you over there. I'm gonna get you. Nope. Missed that one. Come on. Like half of this. Like half of this early part of this game is going to just be me like trying to catch these things no hey there you go was that a, another really are you going to do that are you are you going to play me like that i thought i saw another one around here maybe i was just lied to I'm just going to go back to mining i think i lost <laughs> i think i lost my spot no i think that's it is that it that is it there you go i have my field of view very low because of um uh, the graphic issues I was talking about earlier, just to make it like more bearable for me to play, I might actually go back to my other graphics card. The graphics card that I have now is a a GeForce 950 9500 gra GT graphics card with one um, memory of dedicated, with one gigabyte of dedicated memory or RAM. Forgot what the technical term is. Because I'm not a computer genius. Somewhat. But, um. Yeah, and the other one I have is a Radeon 7450 HD graphics card. Also with 1 gigabyte of dedicated memory. And I might be. Th and I'm thinking about going back to that one. If I'm gonna keep having graphical issues with this one. Because the one I have now. Or at least what my friend told me is a little outdated and new games use a newer version of stuff I forgot but uh, 
Yeah. Just gonna do this again. Alright, so more uranium. How much do I have now? I have 300 again. Just gonna continue doing such things. It's gonna be like a lot of ores in here. Because at some point. No. Are any flying out? Are any flying out? No. There you go. So. I made a hole. I made a hole. The thing I like about hole when doing that is that you can make like a really narrow hole, and that narrow hole like prevents ores from falling out. But it also makes it harder to like walk in in the first place, because you, because as you saw, I was trying to go in, but I wasn't able. I was trying to like go in, so I had to drill some extra. That's the only downside to this. Um, oh, that wasn't something I could pick up. Where's the thing that I could pick up? Flying off into oblivion. Of course. Come back! Mine! There you go. I'm gonna have to come back here later. I think one of the first things I'm going to do is build a mining ship. Because if I build a mining ship, then I'll be able to, like, drill a lot of ores and uranium very quickly. Really quickly. And yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. More oblivion! Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme, 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 gimme. Oh, I just hit it off and... Where the hell? Okay, there you go. You see? Spins off into oblivion really quickly. Spinning. And stuff. There you go. Did I... Is it... It's it's on this one, right? No. Wait, I just lost the thing again. Oh, wow. Um. How much do I have? I, I, I have enough. I have enough. I'm gonna go back to the platform anyways. There you go. Going to the platform again. Inertia dampener is off. Something I do want to mention is that I had a Kerbal Space Program, Kerbal X videos that I posted like three months ago. And I haven't been recording since. I'm sorry for that. You know, school is such a drag, but I want to do good in it and stuff like that. Yada, yada, yada. I'm going to hit it. No, I'm not. <laughs> I was so scared I was going to hit it. Oh, wow. Um, this, go down, jump back off, let's go in here, refinery, I got two grams of uranium, that's like, a lot for what we need now. Alright, so one of the things I want to do, is just, just make that uranium, make that iron. One of the things that I do want to do is, I want to build a cargo container so let's go build a small cargo container a small cargo container will let us get through oh we're gonna need some interior plates interior plates I don't know stop 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 um five just press just press the button scene James you want <laughs> um what do we need for interior plates we need iron ingots we are making that let's just do that for now and iron ingots are made very quickly, so I can just. Anyways, I really don't need this. I think for some type of component, we're going to need gravel, so I'll just put that there. I don't know how much gravel that actually makes, but. Interior plates. We need like 40, right? It's gonna like click a bunch of times and see what happens. We need 40, right? Let me see. Two computers, one display, two motors, 20 small steel tubes, 40 construction components. Wow. It's really big. Keep pressing wrong buttons. Um, we only made 30. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, I'm just going to go ahead and build this cargo container. Oh, no. Another thing that I would like for it to happen is that if you build something... How many... We need, like, 40... Yeah, we do need like 40 of these, don't we? Yeah, 20 large steel tubes, 20 small steel tubes, and 40 construction components. Keep pressing wrong buttons! Um, yeah. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Well, that's being made. While you're in the production tabs, like what tabs? While you're in the production tab, if you double click this, it doesn't go to your inventory. 
but when you go over here and double click it does go into your inventory um comment to the devs which will probably never see this video i might like comment on their steam page but um i would like it so even if you're in production you can double click it goes to your inventory because i find like a lot of people including a lot of people including me and other youtubers and people who play this game um they do like double click on here like a lot of times so they have to like come here and do it it'd be better if you could just like stay here and do it it'd be like a lot much more convenient you need like 40 construction components right 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 So while that's making that, I'm just gonna get more iron How's this doing? Is it not like draining it fa Oh wow Uranium just got like a huge bump up In the last few couple of updates I'm just gonna keep flying downwards Cause I'm boss like that Anyways, there's uranium not uranium, iron. Oh, this is going to be tedious because, you see, gravity is still working in this area. So if I mine this, it's just going to fall down to oblivion. And, um, oh, is, there a is that a sixth one? That's a sixth one. There we go. Probably not going to do anything on that one. Maybe just, bl oh, there's donut. Is there two? Oh, no, that's just the other one. I thought there was, like, two donut-shaped, um, thingies. Anyways, let's just go. Actually, I should get, like energy before I go and actually while doing that I should place down I should put down these materials into so for um, here's fine tap just dump our stuff in there there you go and uh, yeah let's just and energy, energy, press T, there you go. Good boy, good boy. So, let's gain energy, and then let's go back over there to get some iron. I'll refine that iron, and I think I'll call this an episode. For episode one of my solo space engineers let's play. Yes, I think that'll do quite nicely. Whoop! No, wrong button! <laughs> oh, I pressed the wrong button. Uh... That was funny. As you can see, I'm still new to this game. But not that new. I'm still classified as a noob, though. So I guess I am that new, but... I'm not like... Oh my gosh, you don't know anything about this game, get out. Type noob. I'm more of a... Learn the game better, you noob. Type noob. Yes. So, we made it to the iron deposits. Yay! Commence with the chasing after items again. This did it even spawn it? Yeah, here we go. Nope. There you go. Give it. Yes, 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 yes. Let's just get like a bunch of iron. It's gonna fly inside this thing. So was that just was that thing just playing ping pong with? <laughs> it just went like bounced around. Like, let's just like actually go inside so I won't have to chase off and sp let's do it here. Because then it's gonna be like cut off mostly from like space and stuff, and I can actually decently pick up some. This looks really stupid. This does look really stupid, but it actually semi works. It's what I've done to compensate for it. The good thing about iron ore is that it like breaks off in like mega huge chunks, and so you only need like a couple blocks in order to get like 1k, in order to get like 1 kilogram. Like, there was only like a couple of um chunks and I've already got like 500 grams of it. I actually don't know. I'm assuming it's 500 grams because it's using liters and that's the metric system and yeah. I forgot where I was mining. I don't guess it, I guess it really doesn't matter. I guess it really doesn't matter where I was mining. I'll just like do more here. Just pick up some more iron. All that mining. My, okay, I just saw like a really big piece like fall away somewhere. That wasn't it. It was a really big piece. Uh, I don't know where it went. Oh, here it was. Here's that big piece. I knew I wasn't going crazy mostly. Um, I have one kilogram of, of uh, oh yeah, I thought that said plutonium for a second there. I'm gonna think that's, oh, here you go, chunk. 
I'm gonna go back and refine this, and I'm gonna call this an episode. But I keep, but I keep thinking that platform is telling me to, um, um, platinum instead of platform, because I see P L A T, and I'm like, oh, platinum. That's in this game. No, it's platform. You were lied to. Yeah, there you go. We. We. Don't pass it. No, I turn it. <laughs> I turn it off. Wait, I turned my jetpack off. That's why I was flying off into oblivion. Wow. There you go. That 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 just shows you my skill level at this. So let's fly really close to this. Really close to this. Should probably turn on my inertia dampeners. There you go. Inertia damp. I like inertia dampeners in this because inertia dampeners are like so much more powerful than actually like like say if I was going this way and I'm accelerating this way it's going to take a while for it to back out and by that time it might be too late but inertia dampeners just like zero out your like velocity um, really quickly and that's something that's really useful it's like it goes out it just goes away real quickly it, can, it saves lives from what I've seen it saves lives so I'm pretty sure this refinery is still going at it with the uranium. So let's just make it do iron for now and get this iron and then I'll get more energy while that's cooking. And boom goes the dynamite. No, wrong button. <laughs> I don't know why I keep clicking escape for some reason because I think like escape means I'll back out of the menu or something like that. But uh, yeah, that's not what happens. Yay? Yay. I'm going to need motors, which is stuff I really don't know about. I'm gonna need computers, which I do know need gold. Uh, that's not gonna be that's not gonna be easy to get. But it's, it's a good thing because gold, I think, is one of those things where you can get a lot of it, but it doesn't. Where you can get like a lot of ore, but it doesn't give you like a lot of material. It doesn't give you a lot of ingots for it. But then again, I have like not played this since the most recent update, so that might have changed a little bit, just like the uranium did. But um, yeah, let's see what I actually need for a display. I need silicon wafers and gold ingots and stuff. Um, wrong button. No, actually, oh, yeah, that was, that was the right button. <laughs> You're going to the right tab. So for motor, I'm going to need nickel and cobalt. And for computers, I'm going to need gold. So I was right. I'm going to have to go do some more mining. Make tools, wow. Hand drill. Missile container. NATO. Isn't NATO like North American Trade Organization, if I'm wrong? I might be wrong about that, but yeah. Why would you need magnesium powders in an ammo container? I really don't know how guns work. And uh, but um, yeah, I think I'll like call it here. Um, I hope you enjoyed watching this um, episode, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.